Hi Oak Ridge Owls, this video is designed to walk you through how to add comments to our blogs for the summer reading for 5th and 6th graders. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to use this link, okay, and I'm going to click on it in just a minute. Um, you're going to need to have your at oakridgeowls.net account information ready because that's how you'll get onto the blog. Um, and just so you know, you're going to choose three different posts to reply to, um, and those responses should be a solid paragraph, at least six to seven sentences. So let's assume that I've read my books and I'm ready to respond to the blog post. I'm going to click on this and it's going to take me to Kid Blog. The nice thing about Kid Blog um, is that it's password protected. So um, no, um, the only people who can get onto this are the people who um, have this link. And so that's good news in terms of, um, of privacy. So we're going to go to the upper right hand corner of Kid Blog um, and we're going to log in. Okay. Um, and so the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to log in with email. So we'll click on that. And then we're going to say log in with Google. All right. <clears throat> and so you'll see something like this. OK. Um, and you'll see your Oak Ridge Owls .net account, hopefully. Um, if not, you can click right here, use another account, and it will allow you to actually log in using your Oak Ridge Owls .net account. Since mine's right here, I'm going to click this. OK. And then voila, um, I am in. OK. And it says my name up here, Claire Reddick. If at any point you come up here, oh, actually, you know what we need to do. Sorry. Um, we're going to press. Dang it. Hi Oak Ridge Owls, this video is designed to help you get into our kid blog um, and be able to leave comments after you have read your book. So there's going to be a step-by-step -step set of directions that are here on the screen and I'm going to walk you through them. The first thing is that you're going to use this link to access kid blog. You also want to go ahead and pause this video and write this join code down because you'll need it in just a minute. If you don't have your at oakridgeowls.net account information available, you also want to pause and get that as well. Um, and then you're going to get to our kid blog. Please remember that you're going to um, put these, you're going to leave your replies to these posts um, at the end of the book that you've read. You're welcome to preview the post options before you read the book, but you don't want to leave your post comments until after you've read the entire book. You'll choose three of the different posts to reply to, and each response will be a solid paragraph, at least six to seven sentences. Okay, so hopefully you've got the join code and you have your Google information. So we're going to go up to this link and we're going to click on it. Okay, and it's going to take you to this screen. All right, um, and the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go over to this blue button that says join and you're going to click on the join. And then we're going to put in the code that you wrote down. So the code is P G N eight G B Z and I'll press the, the blue button join. Okay. Um, and so then we're actually going to click, take this off because this is me. Okay. Um, and I'm going to sign in with Google. All right. Um, and let's pretend like I don't see my, my account here. Okay. So I'm going to use another account. All right. So I'm going to put my Google account in. All right. And then I'm going to press next. Okay. And then I'm going to right here. Okay. And voila. Okay. So I needed to have the join code. I needed to have my okrajals.net account. I needed to have the password. Okay. And as long as all that information is here, you will then see this screen. Now you're going to click on this one right here. And it's going to take us back to the same screen, except now, because you've logged in, your name is going to be in the upper right hand corner and you're going to have see all of the eight different blog posts. OK, so each of these blog posts represents a different question that you will answer. As I said before, you only have to choose three of these. OK, all of these posts give broad questions that can apply to any book. Um, and so you're not going to be specific to the to the specific book. You're just going to be answering the question. So let me start with this one. Let's say, for instance, I wanted to preview this one, being different. So the question says, if your book has a character who is different from you or from the other characters, explain how they are different, how these differences impact the events in the book, and what you learn from this character. Make sure you include specific details from the book. So if you say to yourself, oh, that's a great one for me to answer. I have a main character that's different. I'm going to scroll down here, and I'm going to start typing here, okay? And once I finish, I'm going to say the... All right, pretend like I've written six to seven questions, okay? Or I've answered, I've written six to seven sentences, okay? I want to spell check and I want to make sure that it all looks good. And then I'm going to press the comment button. 
okay? Um, and my comment is going to be right here. Let's say I look at it, I say, oh no, I actually made a mistake. I'd like to add something. Or wow, I just looked back and it's only four sentences. I can press the edit button and it'll take me back to this screen. And I can actually do that as many times as I want, okay? So let's assume that I'm going to comment, okay? And then I'm going to go up here back to the Oak Ridge Summer Reading 5th or 6th grade list, okay? Um, and then I'm going to choose another one to answer. And I'm ultimately going to choose three total prompts to be able to answer, okay? Um, and once you're done, you are good to go. You can just leave it be um, and enjoy the rest of your summer. That's all it'll take for the, for the prompts. Um, please let me know if you have any questions.